So today's case is a uh, right knee revision. This patient is a 49-year-old male who is status post uh, primary tool knee arthroplasty approximately six years ago. Uh, he developed pain and uh, underwent revision approximately three years post-op because of tibial loosening. There was never any history of any infection. Uh, the issues uh, were the patient was very active in competitive ping pong um, with a lot of lateral high impact activities and at this point has given that up. Um, he's developed more pain now six years post-op and we can review the x-rays and uh, discuss the mechanical loosening that we see. This is an AP of the right knee and uh, what we look at here with regard to loosening is a breakdown of the cement bone interface right here at the tibial plateau. This is a revision tibial component. Uh, problems with this component I think are the fact that the uh, keel is not cemented and the stem is a little bit undersized for the tibial diaphysis <clears throat> and based on the patient's activity level uh, this has led to some mechanical loosening. The femoral component was not revised at the last surgery, but you can also see this has subsided into some varus uh, seen here at the medial femoral condyle. As we move over to the lateral, again uh, we see a breakdown on the interface on the tibial side. Uh, the, it's not a great lateral of the femur, um, but you get a sense that uh, the subsidence is present that we discussed. And this is just a sunrise view showing that the patella does track centrally. Uh, we'll examine this at the time of the surgery and may or may not revise the patellar button depending on how it tracks. 